I am here in Orlando today to meet with our investigators and the state and local partners here on the ground and to support the people of this great city and all of those who've been affected by this devastating tragedy. But I'm also here to reaffirm this administration's unshakable commitment to the safety of our citizens, to the security of our nation, and to the strength of our values. I could not be more proud of all of the members of the Orlando community that I have met with and who are gathering to meet me here today. And I've made clear that the Department of Justice stands with them. Now, there is no doubt that this was a shattering attack on our nation, on our people, and on our most fundamental ideals. But the message of Orlando goes far beyond one night of unspeakable terror. The message of Orlando that I have seen today and what the American people have seen in the wake of this horrific assault is a message of determination to remove hatred and intolerance from our midst, to live our lives freely and without fear, and to stay true to the principles of liberty, justice, and equality that define America at our best. And I'm deeply proud of the way that the federal, state, and local law enforcement officers and first responders here have gone above and beyond the call of duty. And I am so inspired by the strength and the resilience of the survivors and their loved ones. And I am deeply moved by the way that this community and our national community has stood together in support of another in defiance of terror and in defense of our most cherished ideals. And let us be clear, those ideals include the understanding that our diversity makes us stronger and that no matter who we are, what we look like, where we are from, or whom we love, this extraordinary nation belongs to us all. Now I know that the LGBT community in particular has been shaken by this attack. It is indeed a cruel irony that a community that is defined almost exclusively by whom they love is so often a target of hate. And let me say to our LGBT friends and family, particularly to anyone who might view this tragedy as an indication that their identities, that their essential selves might somehow be better left unexpressed or in the shadows, this Department of Justice and your country stands with you in the light. We stand with you to say that the good in this world far outweighs the evil, that our common humanity transcends our differences, and that our most effective response to terror and to hatred is compassion, its unity, and its love. We stand with you today as we grieve together, and long after the cameras are gone, we will continue to stand with you as we grow together.